Local author and illustrator Deborah Friedman is passionate about creating children's books that really inspire kids to go on and draw or paint. Her first book, Scribble, is about two sisters who like to draw and have a scribbling rivalry. Her latest book is called Blue Chicken, and it's the story of a chicken who gets involved with a painting. Joining me now is Deborah Friedman to talk about her new book. And Deborah, it's so adorable. You're so talented. You. Not only did you write the book, but you also illustrate every single page. Thank you. Well, I, I mean, that's what I do. I write with words and pictures together, and I just, I love the picture book form, and I love doing all of that together. So tell me how you got the idea for Blue Chicken. Well, you know, a book is usually a combination of a lot of ideas, but one, one of the things that, um, that came to me is when I, as an illustrator sometimes I'm sitting there at my desk and I'm having all kinds of problems with a painting and I'm thinking oh this is just not turning out right um, what would happen if I just walked away and the painting finished itself mm -hmm. and that's what authors do we ask those what if questions right. and so I love the there answer we that go. you came in because the answer is this cute little chicken. <laughs> Total comes, mayhem. <laughs> comes along as this painting is being done. Right. And the chicken wants to be helpful, right? Mm -hmm. But something terrible goes awry. See, I love this picture. There's a chicken seeing blue paint and thinks, hey, this is pretty great. Yeah, what happens? pretty cool. Well, she gets a little bit too curious and she just wants to help, but the paint spills everywhere. And then and then it goes from there. And everything becomes blue. Yes. You clearly are passionate about the color blue yourself because I understand in Hamden you live in a blue house. Well, part of my house is blue, yes. We live in an old house. We added on to it and the addition is all blue. I love it. And one neighbor actually called it a blue chicken once, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, so when it comes to your books, because you do have this theme of art within the books, mm -hmm. what are you hoping children, I understand you want them to get inspired to draw or paint themselves. Oh, I really do. Um, with Scribble, I really wanted that to happen. I, I go, sometimes I visit children and we scribble together and create scribble characters together. And with Blue Chicken, um, I left the ending a little bit open, I think, um, because what I really love is for children to take off with that. You know, what happens next? So how so. important is it, I mean obviously everyone says parents take time to read with your children. Yes. How important is that time, and then this sounds like a great way to even make it not only a reading project but an art project as well. What do you see happens in their relationship when parent and child work together like that? Well, it, you know, reading to your children is just the most important thing you can do to have them become happy, lifelong readers. I mean, I think that's pretty clear. Right. Um, and it's such special time to spend together. And then you get something to put on the fridge afterwards. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us here, Deborah, today. Thank you. And I know you have an event later I on do. today. She'll be celebrating Blue Chicken with a party and a book signing. It's today at 1.30 to 3 p.m. at the Dixwell Yale Community Learning Center. So check that out this afternoon. And Deborah, author of Blue Chicken, will have much more information about your book on our website as well.